The practice of chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo is central to Nichiren Buddhism, offering practitioners a powerful means of transformation. Many who embrace this practice find themselves experiencing profound physical and emotional benefits. But how does chanting these sacred words have such an impact on the body and mind? Is there a deeper connection between the vibrations of the chant and the human experience? These are questions that point toward the heart of the practice and invite us to explore the benefits of chanting through the lens of Buddhist wisdom. When Nichiren Daishonin revealed Nam Myoho Renge Kyo as the ultimate teaching for this era, he emphasized its ability to unlock the inherent potential within each individual. According to Nichiren, the Lotus Sutra is the king of sutras, true and correct in both word and principle. Its words are the reality of life, and its meaning is the reality of life. Chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo connects us with the core truth of existence the mystic law of the universe, present within all living beings. This connection goes beyond mere mental or spiritual alignment, it has tangible effects on our physical and emotional well-being. The power of sound and vibration. At its essence, chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo is a practice of sound and vibration. The vibrations generated while chanting resonate deeply within the body. In the Lotus Sutra, it is said, this sutra provides a great benefit to those who uphold it and are able to hear its words. These words point to the physicality of sound the way hearing and chanting can stimulate a response in the body, creating harmony between our inner and outer worlds. Modern science even suggests that certain frequencies and vibrations can positively affect our cells, helping to reduce stress, improve circulation, and promote healing. By chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo, practitioners align their personal vibrations with the cosmic rhythm of the universe, often leading to a sense of balance and well being. This practice helps to activate the parasympathetic nervous system, which induces relaxation and reduces feelings of anxiety. Chanting has been shown to lower blood pressure and heart rate, creating a calm, centered state that directly benefits physical health. Emotional transformation through chanting. Beyond the physical, chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo is a profound tool for emotional healing. Life is full of challenges, and it's easy to become overwhelmed by negative emotions like anger, fear, and sadness. However, Nichiren Daishonin teaches us that through chanting, we can transform even the darkest of feelings into the light of wisdom and courage. In one of his letters, Nichiren writes, When we chant the Daimoku of the Lotus Sutra, our minds naturally become peaceful and happy. Chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo enables practitioners to face their inner struggles with a new perspective. Rather than being consumed by anger or sorrow, the chant empowers individuals to confront their emotions, understand their root causes, and eventually transform them. This process is not one of suppression but of true emotional growth. As Nichiren says, the sufferings of birth and death are nirvana meaning that within our deepest struggles lies the potential for the highest enlightenment. Many people who chant report feeling lighter, more hopeful, and emotionally resilient. This emotional resilience comes from the understanding that by chanting, they are actively transforming their negative karma the cause of suffering into the source of wisdom. Chanting becomes a vehicle for turning negative experiences into opportunities for growth, which ultimately leads to a deeper sense of emotional peace and fulfillment. Healing the body and mind, chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo is said to awaken the inherent Buddha nature within each person. In the Gosho, Nichiren Daishonin writes, If you chant Myoho and recite the Sutra, you will not only eradicate negative karma but also naturally manifest the inherent enlightenment that lies dormant within you. This awakening has a profound impact on both physical and emotional health. By chanting, practitioners unlock this latent energy which can lead to physical healing. There are countless examples of people who have experienced improved health after beginning the practice of chanting. From recovering from chronic illnesses to gaining the strength to overcome physical challenges, chanting appears to have a regenerative effect on the body. But how is this possible? The answer may lie in the holistic nature of Buddhist practice. When one chants, they are not only engaging their voice but their heart, mind, and spirit. The unity of these elements creates a powerful healing force. In many ways, this mirrors the Buddhist concept of the oneness of body and mind. Just as our thoughts and emotions can influence our physical health, 
our spiritual practices can bring harmony to both. The mind is capable of creating illness when it is clouded by negativity, but when enlightened through chanting, it can generate health and vitality. As Nichiren Daishonin expressed, Nam Myoho Renge Kyo is like the roar of a lion. What illness can therefore be an obstacle? The role of faith and determination. It's important to recognize that the benefits of chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo are not merely the result of repeating words but are deeply connected to one's faith and determination. The transformative power of chanting arises from a deep belief in the mystic law and a strong desire to align one's life with it. Nichiren Daishonin taught that chanting without faith is like trying to start a fire without striking a flint. Faith, combined with action, creates the momentum needed to bring about real change. In the Lotus Sutra, we are told, to accept, uphold, read, and recite the Lotus Sutra is to arouse a great and powerful desire for enlightenment. This teaching reminds us that chanting is not a passive activity. It is a bold declaration to the universe that we are ready to transform our lives, heal our bodies, and overcome our emotional struggles. The more deeply we chant with faith and determination, the greater the benefits we experience. Through this practice, practitioners often find that they develop a greater sense of self-confidence and inner strength. This confidence stems from the realization that they are not powerless in the face of adversity. By chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo, they are actively working to shift their circumstances and improve their well-being. This empowerment is one of the most profound emotional benefits of the practice. Overcoming Life's Obstacles One of the central teachings of Nichiren Buddhism is that obstacles and challenges are not something to avoid or dread but are instead opportunities for growth. Nichiren himself faced incredible hardships throughout his life, including exile and persecution but he remained steadfast in his faith. He often encouraged his followers to see their struggles as a way to deepen their practice and strengthen their resolve. He wrote, Winter always turns to spring, reminding us that no matter how difficult a situation may seem, it can and will transform. This perspective has a direct impact on emotional health. By viewing challenges as opportunities for growth, practitioners can approach life with a sense of hope and optimism. Rather than feeling defeated by difficult circumstances, they see them as stepping stones toward enlightenment. This shift in mindset helps reduce stress, anxiety, and feelings of helplessness, all of which can contribute to emotional suffering. The Science of Chanting While the physical and emotional benefits of chanting have been acknowledged for centuries in Buddhist teachings, modern science is beginning to offer explanations that support these ancient insights. Research has shown that repetitive chanting can activate certain regions of the brain associated with positive emotions and a sense of calm. This process, known as entrainment, aligns the brain's neural rhythms with the vibrations of the chant, promoting a state of relaxation and mental clarity. Moreover, chanting in a group whether during a Buddhist meeting or personal practice can foster a sense of community and connectedness. This social aspect of chanting strengthens emotional bonds and provides a support system that is essential for emotional well-being. When practitioners come together to chant, they are not only working on their individual transformation but also contributing to the collective growth of the community. This shared experience can be deeply healing, both emotionally and physically. The practice of chanting Nam Myoho Renge Kyo offers profound physical and emotional benefits. By aligning our vibrations with the mystic law, we tap into the inherent healing potential within us. Chanting reduces stress, improves emotional resilience, and helps us face life's challenges with courage and determination. As Nichiren Daishonin teaches, when we chant Nam Myoho Renge Kyo, we summon forth our innate Buddhahood, and the wisdom to overcome any difficulty emerges. Through this practice, we not only heal our bodies and minds but also uncover the boundless potential for happiness and enlightenment that resides within each of us. The benefits of chanting are not confined to the spiritual realm. They reach into the very core of our physical and emotional existence, transforming our lives from the inside out.